Hi all folks, this is Max from root, RazorRoot.com. So today we're going to back up um, our current ROM. Um, this is what you should do before installing another ROM. This basically backs up your whole ROM kernel, your apps, um, everything. Um, so do the, to do this, um, you'll have to... You can do this with uh, Bionic Bootstrap or I recommend uh, SafeStrap. If you don't have SafeStrap installed, I highly recommend um, you to install it and this guide is based on for um, safe strap um, because it's a lot safer. So uh, once you install the uh, safe strap you should be able to um, reboot and get into um, get into the your clockwork mod recovery, the recovery portion. Um, so we're gonna do that. So just power off. And uh, for those of you who have SafeStrap installed, you should um, get an uh, option to enter recovery um, when you reboot. So let me power up. And let's enter recovery. SafeStrap is highly recommended um, because it allows you to enter recovery during boot. Um, so here, hit the menu button to, hit, uh, to enter the um, recovery. And in recovery, we're gonna make up a uh, backup our whole ROM. Um, make sure safe system says it's disabled. Let me adjust the camera real quick. So here, um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to backup and restore using the volume down button, and hit the power button, and hit uh, it's on backup. So hit the power button again. And you have a choice to back up to the internal or the external SD card here. I highly recommend you to do it on the external SD card because um, you can always move it to your hard disk, move it to another Droid Razor. So let's do that. You can always access it um, and hit the power button. Hit, say yes. Um, so this is going to back up your whole system. Uh, and once you've got all that backed up, um, you can install ROMs, um, you know, break your phone, and you'll, you can always restore it back to um, your original, probably stock rooted ROM. Um, always have a, also when you unroot it, you can always flash your uh, old stock ROM and simply unroot it. It makes everything a lot simpler. So this should take about 10 minutes, and I'm gonna just let it do its thing, and when we come back, um, our system should be backed up and uh, we can always uh, enter recovery and use the restore feature to restore. So I'll be back. Hi right, folks, so you should get all this stuff backing up system, backing up data. Um, that's fine. Once you get backup complete, you're all done and anytime you want to uh, restore back to your older ROM, just go back to backup and restore and go to restore and choose external or internal wherever you put your um, folder to and it says non safe 2011 12-17.21.58.41 so that shows you the date and the time um, so you can actually copy this whole folder um, it should be I'm not sure what it's under but it's, it's not somewhere in your um, external storage and you can copy it over to your computer um, if you don't want to take up space in your SD card. Copy it back, you know. Um, that's about it. And next, uh, we're gonna do. Um, we're gonna go install a new ROM. So, that's how you back up and restore ROMs. All right. See y'all later. Subscribe.